The echoes of history often bring forth tales of grand civilizations that have left an indelible mark on the annals of time. While names like Rome, Egypt, and Mesopotamia resound in our collective consciousness, there exists a tapestry of lesser-known societies waiting to be unveiled. One such enigma is the Saxony civilization, a mysterious chapter in the human story that beckons exploration and understanding. Join us on a journey through the pages of history as we endeavor to unravel the mysteries of the Saxony civilization, a journey that promises not only to uncover the past but also to redefine our present understanding of the rich tapestry of human civilizations. Through meticulous exploration and scholarly inquiry, we aspire to resurrect the forgotten echoes of Saxony, inviting you to witness the resurgence of a civilization lost in the shadows. The Saxony civilization flourished in a region of Europe characterized by a diverse landscape, where the fertile plains of the North German plain meet the rugged terrain of the Central European uplands. The heartland of Saxony was nestled along the Elbe River, encompassing parts of present-day Germany and extending into neighboring regions. The geographic diversity, ranging from fertile valleys to dense forests, played a pivotal role in shaping the lifestyle and economic activities of the Saxons. The Elbe River, a lifeline for the Saxony civilization, not only facilitated trade and transportation but also influenced settlement patterns and agricultural practices. The fertile soils along the riverbanks allowed for the cultivation of crops, contributing to the sustenance and growth of the civilization. Dense forests, rich in natural resources, provided materials for construction, fuel, and various economic activities, contributing to the self-sufficiency of the Saxons. Piecing together the timeline of the Saxony civilization poses a formidable challenge due to the scarcity of written records. Scholars rely on a combination of archaeological evidence, ancient texts from neighboring civilizations, and scientific dating methods to construct a tentative chronology. The Saxony civilization is believed to have emerged during the early centuries of the first millennium common era, with its zenith reached during the early medieval period. Key milestones in the timeline include the establishment of early settlements, the formation of a distinct cultural identity, and periods of expansion and consolidation. The civilization's timeline is marked by events such as significant agricultural advancements, the construction of key infrastructure, and interactions with neighboring societies. The Saxony civilization existed within a web of interactions with neighboring cultures, each leaving an imprint on the other. To the south, Interactions with the Carolingian Empire were marked by both cooperation and conflict. Trade routes connected Saxony to the wealth and cultural exchange facilitated by the empire, but the tensions between the Saxons and Carolingians, including military conflicts, also punctuated their relationship. To the east, the Saxons engaged with Slavic tribes, fostering a dynamic exchange of goods, ideas, and technologies. These interactions influenced the cultural landscape of both societies, creating a mosaic of shared influences. The Saxons' encounters with Norse and Baltic cultures further enriched their worldview, contributing to the unique tapestry of the Saxony civilization. The social fabric of the Saxony civilization was intricately woven with a system of class hierarchy and social stratification that reflected the complexities of its society. At the apex of this structure were the elite, comprising nobility, landowners, and influential figures whose wealth and status were often hereditary. The nobility played a crucial role in governance, holding sway over political decisions, land distribution, and military matters. Beneath the elite, a middle class emerged, consisting of merchants, skilled artisans, and professionals. This stratum contributed significantly to the economic prosperity of Saxony, engaging in trade, craftsmanship, and intellectual pursuits. The majority of the population belonged to the lower class, primarily engaged in agriculture and manual labor. While this division was not rigid, with opportunities for social mobility, it nevertheless shaped the dynamics of Saxony's society. Saxony's political organization was characterized by a blend of feudal structures and tribal governance. The Saxons were organized into tribes, each led by chieftains or tribal leaders, who held authority over their respective territories. As the civilization expanded and faced external pressures, the need for a more centralized authority became evident. Over time, the Saxony civilization evolved towards a more centralized political structure. The emergence of regional dukes and a central monarchy marked a shift towards a more cohesive governance system. 
The role of the monarch became pivotal, not only as a political leader but also as a symbol of unity and stability. The monarchy, however, often had to contend with the influence of powerful nobles, leading to a delicate balance of power within the political landscape. The legal and judicial systems of the Saxony civilization reflected the socio-political values of the time. Local communities often adhered to customary laws that were passed down through oral traditions, governing issues ranging from property disputes to criminal offenses. As the civilization matured, attempts were made to codify and standardize legal principles. The judicial system featured a combination of local courts and a central court presided over by the monarch or appointed judges. The severity of punishments varied based on the nature of the crime and the social status of the accused. Legal proceedings often incorporated elements of customary law, with a reliance on witness testimonies and, in some cases, trial by ordeal. The linguistic landscape of the Saxony civilization was shaped by a rich tapestry of dialects and languages, reflective of the diverse tribes and regions within its domain. Although written records are scarce, linguistic evidence and traces from neighboring civilizations provide insights into the languages spoken. A Germanic language, likely an early form of Old Saxon, served as a common means of communication among the Saxons. Communication within the society was not solely linguistic. Symbols, rituals, and oral traditions played crucial roles in conveying cultural values and shared experiences. The exchange of ideas and information occurred not only through spoken words but also through artistic expressions, reinforcing the cultural bonds that bound the Saxony people together. The spiritual landscape of the Saxony civilization was infused with a pantheon of deities and a complex system of religious beliefs. Like many Germanic tribes, the Saxons practiced a polytheistic faith, venerating gods associated with nature, fertility, war, and other aspects of daily life. Among these deities, figures like Woden, Odin, Thunor, Thor, and Frigg held prominent places in the Saxon pantheon. Rituals and ceremonies were integral to Saxon religious practices, often conducted in sacred groves, natural landmarks, or designated temples. These ceremonies marked important life events, seasonal changes, and sought divine favor for endeavors such as agriculture and warfare. The spiritual beliefs of the Saxons not only provided a framework for understanding the world but also served as a cohesive force, fostering a shared cultural identity. The artistic and architectural expressions of the Saxony civilization reflected both utilitarian needs and aesthetic sensibilities. In the absence of monumental stone structures, the Saxons utilized wood, thatch, and other locally available materials for construction. Village settlements featured longhouses, communal meeting spaces, and defensive structures. Artistic endeavors were often intertwined with religious or symbolic significance. Intricately carved wooden artifacts, metalwork, and textiles showcased the craftsmanship and creativity of the Saxons. Symbolism and patterns were woven into everyday items, illustrating a keen awareness of aesthetics. Technological advancements in Saxony were marked by innovation in metallurgy, agriculture, and textile production. Iron tools and weapons facilitated agricultural practices and contributed to the defense of settlements. Textile production, utilizing materials such as wool and flax, showcased the Saxon skill in harnessing local resources for economic and cultural pursuits. Agriculture formed the backbone of the Saxony civilization, sustaining its growing population and fostering economic stability. The fertile plains along the banks of the Elbe River were cultivated for various crops, including grains, vegetables, and fruits. The agrarian practices of the Saxons were characterized by a blend of traditional methods and innovations, allowing them to adapt to the diverse geographic features of their region. Trade played a pivotal role in the economic life of Saxony. The strategic location of their settlements along major river routes facilitated both local and long-distance trade. The Saxons engaged in a lively exchange of goods, including agricultural produce, textiles, and artisanal products. Trade routes connected Saxony to neighboring civilizations, fostering cultural interchange and contributing to the wealth and diversity of the Saxony economy. The economic interactions of the Saxony civilization extended beyond its borders, engaging with neighboring cultures through a complex network of trade and diplomacy. 
While the Saxons primarily engaged in a barter system for local transactions, the emergence of trade with more distant societies prompted the adoption of currency. Trade routes connected Saxony to the Carolingian Empire to the south, the Slavic tribes to the east, and Norse and Baltic cultures to the north. This web of economic connections necessitated the use of standardized currency for transactions. The adoption of coins, often minted with the image of rulers or symbolic representations, facilitated economic exchanges and solidified the Saxons' participation in the broader economic landscape of medieval Europe. Technological advancements in commerce played a crucial role in the economic prosperity of Saxony. The Saxons were adept metalworkers, utilizing iron and other metals to create tools, implements, and weaponry. This not only enhanced agricultural productivity but also contributed to the development of a robust trade network. Innovations in transportation, including the use of riverine routes and the construction of navigational aids, facilitated the movement of goods across the Saxony region and beyond. The development of watermills, powered by the flowing rivers, improved grain milling and other industrial processes, enhancing the efficiency of production. The establishment of marketplaces in key settlements became focal points for economic activity. These marketplaces allowed for the exchange of goods and ideas, contributing to the cultural and economic vibrancy of Saxony. Specialized craftsmen, such as blacksmiths, weavers, and potters, played essential roles in diversifying the economic landscape, creating goods not only for local consumption but also for trade. The family unit was the cornerstone of daily life in the Saxony civilization, providing the framework for social cohesion and support. Families typically lived in longhouses within close-knit village communities. The family structure was patriarchal, with the father serving as the head of the household and responsible for decision-making, property management, and representing the family in the broader community. The roles within the family were clearly defined. Women were primarily responsible for domestic tasks, including cooking, childcare, and textile production. Men, on the other hand, were engaged in agriculture, hunting, and, in some cases, participated in trade or military activities. Extended families often lived in proximity, fostering strong kinship ties that extended beyond the nuclear family. Children played a crucial role in familial continuity, inheriting the responsibilities and skills of their parents. Education within the family unit revolved around imparting practical skills, cultural values, and the nuances of daily life in Saxony. Education in Saxony was a blend of informal, familial instruction and, in some cases, more formalized learning. The transmission of knowledge primarily occurred within the family, with parents passing on essential skills and cultural traditions to their children. This included agricultural practices, craftsmanship, and an understanding of religious and social customs. In more organized settings, local communities might have had wise men or women, often associated with spiritual or religious roles, who served as repositories of knowledge. Their teachings encompassed a wide range of subjects, from the medicinal properties of plants to stories of cultural significance. Oral traditions played a crucial role in preserving and transmitting the history and values of the Saxony people. While formalized institutions of education were limited, the Saxons valued intellectual pursuits. Their language, rich in expressions and symbolism, reflected a nuanced understanding of their environment and cultural identity. Artistic expressions, including intricate carvings and textile designs, showcased the creativity and intellectual acumen of the Saxons. Daily life in Saxony was not solely centered around work. Recreational and entertainment activities held a significant place in the lives of its inhabitants. Festivals and celebrations marked important milestones, such as harvests, solstices, and religious observances. These communal gatherings provided opportunities for socializing, feasting, and participating in traditional dances and music. Sports and games were common forms of recreation. Simple ball games and various contests were enjoyed by both children and adults. Hunting, a practical necessity for food procurement, also had recreational aspects, as it allowed individuals to hone their skills and foster a sense of camaraderie within the community. The Saxons also appreciated storytelling and oral traditions as a form of entertainment. Skilled storytellers wove tales of heroic deeds, mythological adventures, and historical events, providing both education and amusement to their audiences. Daily life in Saxony, 
therefore, was a tapestry woven with familial bonds, intellectual pursuits, and moments of joy and celebration. The balance between work and recreation reflected the resilience and vibrancy of a civilization that found fulfillment not only in the practicalities of daily existence but also in the cultural and social expressions that enriched their lives. The Saxony civilization, like any complex society, experienced internal conflicts and power struggles that shaped its political landscape. The hierarchical structure, with a centralized authority and influential nobility, often led to tensions and rivalries. Power struggles among competing factions within the nobility were not uncommon, as individuals vied for control over resources, territories, and influence within the society. Tribal and regional identities could also become sources of internal tension. The decentralized nature of governance, with local chieftains exercising significant autonomy, sometimes led to conflicts over authority and jurisdiction. These internal power struggles could have far-reaching consequences, affecting the stability and cohesion of the Saxony civilization. The Saxony civilization faced external threats and invasions from various quarters throughout its existence. The proximity to powerful neighbors, such as the Carolingian Empire to the south, exposed the Saxons to geopolitical pressures. The shifting dynamics of medieval Europe, marked by territorial expansion and conquests, led to intermittent conflicts with neighboring civilizations. The Carolingian Saxon Wars, for example, were a series of conflicts between the Saxons and the Carolingian Empire. These wars, spanning several decades, were characterized by military campaigns, territorial disputes, and attempts by the Carolingians to subjugate the Saxons. The external pressures and invasions not only tested the military resilience of the Saxons but also influenced their political and cultural development. Natural disasters posed another set of challenges to the Saxony civilization. The region's susceptibility to floods, storms, and other environmental hazards could disrupt agricultural activities, damage infrastructure, and lead to widespread hardships. The Elbe River, vital for trade and transportation, could also be a source of both prosperity and peril as floods could devastate settlements along its banks. The impact of natural disasters extended beyond the immediate consequences on agriculture and infrastructure. Famine, disease, and displacement resulting from such events could strain societal structures, exacerbate existing tensions, and pose challenges to the resilience of the Saxony people. Internal dissension and political fragmentation emerged as significant factors contributing to the decline of the Saxony civilization. The hierarchical structure, which had once provided stability, eventually gave way to internal power struggles, weakening the cohesion of the society. Noble factions vying for supremacy and regional leaders asserting autonomy eroded the centralized governance that had characterized earlier periods. Political fragmentation weakened the ability of the Saxons to present a unified front against external threats. The internal divisions likely hampered their response to challenges, both from neighboring civilizations and from within the Saxony territories. The erosion of political unity made the civilization more vulnerable to external pressures. The external pressures faced by the Saxons played a pivotal role in their decline. The Carolingian Empire, under leaders such as Charlemagne, sought to subjugate the Saxons and incorporate their territories into the expanding Carolingian realm. The Carolingian Saxon Wars, spanning the late 8th to early 9th centuries, witnessed military campaigns, forced conversions to Christianity, and the establishment of Carolingian authority over Saxony. The imposition of foreign rule and the suppression of Saxon cultural and religious practices likely fueled discontent among the Saxons. While they continued to resist, the external pressures, both militaristic and ideological, contributed to the erosion of their distinct societal structures. Changes in economic dynamics and environmental factors also played a role in the decline of the Saxony civilization. Shifts in trade routes, the emergence of new economic centers, and evolving geopolitical landscapes may have disrupted the economic foundations that sustained the Saxons. Natural disasters, which had always posed a threat, could have intensified during this period, exacerbating existing challenges. The decline may have been gradual, marked by economic decline, social upheaval, and a dwindling population. The inability to adapt to changing circumstances, whether due to internal strife, external pressures, or environmental challenges, likely contributed to the fading prominence of the Saxony civilization. 
While the Saxony civilization may have faded from the historical stage, its legacy endured in various forms. Elements of Saxon culture persisted, influencing subsequent societies in the region. The resistance against external domination left an indelible mark on the collective memory of the Saxons and contributed to the shaping of regional identities. The decline and disappearance of the Saxony civilization remind us of the complex interplay of internal and external forces that shape the trajectory of civilizations. It serves as a testament to the impermanence of human societies, the dynamic nature of history, and the importance of understanding the intricate factors that contribute to the rise and fall of civilizations. In conclusion, the exploration of the Saxony civilization reveals a captivating narrative of a society nestled along the banks of the Elbe River, its rise, flourishing, and eventual decline. Summarizing the key findings, we discern the intricate interplay of factors that shaped the Saxons' daily lives, from their social structures and governance to their cultural expressions, economic endeavors, and the challenges they faced. By delving further into the annals of Saxony's history, researchers have the opportunity to shed light on the nuanced interactions between internal and external forces, the resilience of the Saxons in the face of challenges, and the enduring impact of their civilization on the broader historical tapestry of medieval Europe. As we embark on this journey of discovery, the story of the Saxony civilization becomes not just a chapter in the past but a gateway to understanding the intricacies of human societies and the lessons they hold for our own complex and ever-evolving world.